Welcome back to Felseal, where we are currently uh, sitting with a party of lots of AP using people. And I press the wrong buttons as a standard. Um, we are. I read up, by the way, uh, at the at the pa at the patch. There was a bunch of balance changes. For one thing, gave gave a bunch of holy to the mark class, which is nice. Um, I don't know if I should save for holy burst. Or if I should start picking up other stuff. At the moment, Burst hasn't been super great. And I really don't like the whole at a cost of my current HP. I hate that. That's part of why I don't really like the class that Anodyne currently is. So the other option is slow. But I don't want this as my counter. Because um, she can't use... She only has one counter. I would much rather have counter attack than slow for that one. So at the moment... I don't really know. Like, it's possible Drain Soul if I ever feel like I need a bunch of mana. But to be honest, she's not going to have a lot of MND damage. Like, so that's not really that much. Much rather Drain Health, you know? <laughs> like, it could be nice, but I'd rather just kill people. So at the moment, I'm just not really going to spend anything on her. Um, other option here. Mizuki is currently leveling Druid. Um, even if I'm not super, super into Druid so far, it does seem neat. Which, by the way, I can pick up some stuff. Um, getting enough points in Druid will lead to this class which is has economy and eruptor whatever the hell that means i'm excited about that oh hey last night we reached our goal of a hundred thousand dollars for charity water oh awesome charity water is my go-to have you guys ever gone to shop at amazon and they have this thing where they ask you like hey you can go uh, shop at smile.amazon.com which means blah 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 percentage of everything you do will go to a charity of your choice charity water is the one um i i, I have for that one because i think that's pretty cool but yeah so this one is probably the druid one is probably the one i want to go for you eventually um mizuki that's the plan uh at the moment you're just sort of learning abilities i can pick up a mercenary i guess power strike i guess <laughs> Just to unlock something. Uh, Rainer is currently really... like The Gadgeteer was amazing. Uh, but to be honest, I don't see a lot of reasons to um, level up the actual class much. I don't seem to gain uh, that much. Like, they're, they're, they're not bad, these things. But they're not really something I feel like I need to do a lot of. I'm mostly just picking up Mercenary here. So I want to pick up, like, useful stuff like Counter-Attack, Sturdy Grip, and so on and so on. In fact, what do I currently have on him? counter because of, Yeah, so that's pretty good. Rainer has become pretty useful class. Manati is currently like... Um, he's Master Wizard. So he's on Mercenary. The, no, he's not on Mercenary at the moment. He, he's on Mender at the moment. Just picking up heals and shit. Just so... Can, can double as whatever it is need to be. Currently, you're just basically like... Either healer or... You know, it's like a white black mage at the moment. Uh, Angel is leveling Plague Doctor. Um, you needed to, you wanted to level Plague Doctor because you needed to want to become. Uh, what was you wanted to be? This is it this one maybe. I don't. I can't remember which one. Which one was. Stream Alexa. Stream Alexa, please. If you could, if you could copy paste um, what it was we wanted to do. Because I've forgotten, I guess. What is the Darth Vader class? Um, which one is the Darth Vader class? This one? <laughs> That's alchemistic. <laughs> yeah, you're mostly only healing yourself. That's fine, you get experience for that. <laughs> um, good afternoon. Good afternoon to you too, Slack God. I assume so, yeah. Uh, this is something I haven't looked at much. But if you look at... Um, wrong button. If you look at also um, in the top right, you can see growth. You can see how many stats they gain from a level. So leveling up in marks gives me 7 HP, 2 per 5, and attack and so on. So if I want to get like the most attack, I want to make sure I level up a lot in, uh, well, not really, like this class. Or this class. Or, of course, marked. So Kyrie is going to end up being really fucking strong. Um... And so on, which is why caster classes will end up being good casters and so on. So level something up as one and then trying to... So even if I, for example, decide out of the blue, like, you know what, Angel's been a caster for 20 of her levels, I'm going to make her a knight. She won't have good stats for that. 
because her leveling up into level 9 in cancer classes means she had a lot of stuff. So Marin, mercenary for starter group encounter, then knight 4. Angel, plague doctor, then beyond. Uh, Sapphire, mercenary knight, ranger 4. Spoonman, mender until plague doctor again. Okay, thank you, Stream Alexa. Well done. Um, speaking of, uh, we were maxing out the ranger for Sapphire just because it's we might as well. Like, we only need about 100 more for Rain of Arrows, and then she'll have a mastered ranger. Uh, after that, we will be going into Mercenary and uh, Knight eventually. Uh, we need level 4 of each other, so yeah. Uh, here's Turin. Turin has been a peddler recently, and I've really gotten to like this class, actually. I think this class seemed a bit weird at first, but now I've really gotten to like it. The trap is nice, uh, because it bleeds and ends their turn. Now, the thing is, all the other traps do that as well. A painful trap seems really strong, personally. So that's something I want to pick up as well. Um, this one is even any better, because if the charms, they work on my side. So eventually, I want to pick up all these traps. But for now, I've got Night Impotency, because doubles the use of a potion. Um, and Quick Fingers, meaning you can open climb. You'll be the ones running around the map actually doing things, which is why I think I want to... I think I want to give you the, um, the running shoes. That currently Sapphire has. No. Because I want you to be able to move around fast. And that means that you can have... I guess... You already have good evasion, so why not stack that even more with some Demigontal? Yeah, let's do it. Um, Spoonman is a Plague Doctor in all but heart, but currently he can't be. Because <laughs> I needed to swap him to Wizard so that he could pick up Smart Casting. Which I did. Uh, but once I swapped him away from Plague Doctor, he couldn't go back to Plague Doctor because he didn't have the prerequisites for it. So, um, we at the moment are working on other stuff. Uh, man, I thought... Radio, I guess, I guess. Plague Doctor's been unlocked! Yeah, he can go back to being a Plague Doctor! Guys, he can, he can beat again! Plague Doctor! He's back, baby! Uh, throw a Wizzy Glove on him, I suppose. Hmm. I'm five points away from Into the Fray. This one I really like. The is like having more adjacent enemies means he does a lot more damage. It's really good for stuff like Poison Burst. Well, really only Poison Burst. <laughs> and I guess normal Poison. Or just attacking. Total shield. And I can put that on so that you can equip all kinds of tanky shit. Which I probably will eventually. And then tank him the fuck up. And just send uh, send um, Spoon into the middle of everyone. Have everyone attack him and then he poison bursts everyone as well. Good times. But that's the plan for Spoonman at the moment. Uh, I would want to make sure that I have useful... I don't have a lot of useful passive abilities though. That might be something worth maybe picking up. In other classes. I don't know. Health expert would be nice considering if you're gonna go in there to be tanky. But maybe you'll get enough mercenary points as we go without that. Plague Dark yourself doesn't really get. I mean, I'll get armor proficiency and into the fray. And then. Yeah, I think all I really want then is, like, maybe Health Expert. Or possibly, um... And now what I can sell Rhythm Merch at store.youngscast.com. Use the code RITHIAN for 10% off. Oh, by the way, if you guys have, like, a cool idea for a t-shirt, let me know. Um, should we just max out her Mercenary? Why not? Bablamo. Anna is now maxed out Mercenary, which is great. Um, I mean, she's not really using it <laughs> anymore, but... Because she's still in the Demonite class. Which, by the way, I want to avoid uh, this one that dam damages me by a fourth. But it's good for key moments when you need to do tons of damage. This one could be useful because it's only a sixth. This one is a fifth, but I... Not sure about that one. I don't like the one where the damages her HP. Why? Stop. Stop doing that. This is really cool, though. 
If I kill someone, she gets another turn. That's really cool. I want to get that eventually. Regular attacks use all current MP to inflict more damage. That's pretty cool, but I mean... That means I basically can't use any <laughs> anything that costs mana. But nothing of... Only really Wrathful Burst costs mana, but the problem is I'll have to end up using... Why do I have to pick that up? I don't like it. <laughs> Whatever. We'll, uh, we'll learn that as we go. This is Yates. Yates is at least going to pick up a point here for no real reason. But he's still just leveling up in an Atomist. I'm gonna... He's doing a lot of damage now because he's got Pain Points and Dark 1 and Dark 2. I will eventually go down to Dark Locus as well. And then pick up Healer while we're at it because, I mean, we might as well. He's probably just going to stick with that. But if it's a bonus to pick up a little bit of extra in, in uh, Mender. Because he'll probably end up being a little bit of a healer as well. I do want to pick up a counter attack ability though. Probably Lurg Renew. Oh, Cripple actually. It's not half bad either. And then Marin, our newest recruit probably, I think. Everyone did hate the 8s, yeah. But he basically needs to tag along to keep keep an eye out on Anodine. So. Um, Marin is the knight. We are picking up stuff with the knight. Uh, next up is either a choice of the No Flank or f Life Font. I think Life Font is what I'm going to go for. Uh, Marin needs abilities, because currently she has no abilities, really. Which is why she's currently in Mercenary. So I want to pick up Counterattack, I want to pick up Health Expert, and I want to pick up Sturdy Grip. I want to pick up all those things. So that's why we're getting points into that for her. So that's what we're currently doing, and we are also trying to do some story. And in fact, we are going to do some story now. I don't need to save, because I... Well, no, I have done a few things, I think. Is everyone equipped properly? Sorry, quick look around to see if anyone's equipped. Uh, Maul, good stuff, yes. Maul and no armor, because he doesn't have sturdy grip yet, right? Wait, can he have... Can you have a shield? No, you don't have sturdy grip. That's not yet. Okay, good, good. We will eventually pick that up. Um, staff, good. White staff. Isn't that a pretty lame staff? Yes, it is. We should pick you, pick you up a better staff. At the very least, a silver staff. Silver mace and a... What did I tell you about equipping that there? <laughs> That's spots for shields. Oh yeah, you've managed to grab the monk robe, the item we found in that other thing. They changed the class tree again, now you need to be a druid. What the fuck, Angel? <laughs> okay? Okay. So no plague doctor on you. You need to be a druid, which means... You need... You can swap to it right now, actually. Alright. Well, you're still currently a caster. And you can't really heal at the moment. You're just... Yeah. What's equipment like? Mostly the same. Leather helmet, monk robe. Fine. If I could, I'd grab you a... A bet. Well, actually, this is better. This isn't... The silver circle is better. Let's throw that on. Yeah. And the good old monk robe... Is... F just flat out way better. Okay, leveling you as a druid as well. Mizuki could be a full-time under wizard unless I want double cast. I think double cast is really good. The thing is, at the moment, you're still fulfilling your role because you have a lot of useful um, healing, and that's mostly what I'm using you for anyway. So picking you up druid also means that there's a little bit of a carrier's learning going on to both people, so that helps. Well, I don't know if that's how it works, actually. It might not. But, uh, but getting double cast is a pretty good idea anyway. Um... I don't know, because I'd like to replace uh, Fortitude with Double Cast, or something like that. Um, okay, we're we're good. We're solid. Wait, did I check all the equipment? We haven't even played the game yet. <clears throat> uh, silver Bow, Leather Armor, Demon Gauntlet, Silver Axe, Steel Shield. Uh, yeah, you've got an axe now. Turn. Uh, silver Staff, Steel Shield, good there too. Silver Scythe, yeah. Wait, don't you have Sturdy Grip? You do. We need a shield. For, for you. Why can't you? 
equip another? Because the scythe is two-handed, but you have sturdy grip. Why does shields not show up for you here? Please explain. Is this just the class? Maybe it's just the, this class cannot equip shields, period. I think that's probably what it is. I think demonites just can't. Well, we actually don't have any shields left. They're all being used at the moment. But it doesn't matter anyway. They show up even if you don't, like... If you're on a class that can't equip a shield, it showed up because they did it earlier. I think just demonites can't use it. So, actually, that means that sturdy grip is pointless for you. And in fact, we can give you, I guess, smart casting. <laughs> it doesn't matter. But yeah. Because you can't use it anyway, I think, as a, as a, as a demonite. He's got all the best casting stuff. I don't know why he has a plate glove, but, you know. In fact, it might be better to throw the plate glove on you. Because it is a chunk of defense. And throw you a demigauntlet, I guess. Okay. Okay, it's more than enough time to go. Here we go. RPG outfit to simulate the 2019. Yeah, yeah. Wait, Marin has a. Sh we have given Marin her weapon, right? Shit, more bandits. Oh god, I hope so. I did save though, so I could reset if, if I don't have it. Oh good, more bandits. You can hardly walk down the road without tripping over them. Has it always been this bad? The pilgrimage has made things worse. The arbiters have been stretched thin dealing with the chaos in the Mark's Wake. On the bright side, once your pilgrimage is complete, you'll be in a position to do something about it. Thanks, Rainer. What's this? A group of trespassers, traipsing down our road careless as you please. Come on, fellas. There's still time for a bit of fun before the big job. Kill them all and we'll split the loot when we're done. Bold of you. I don't meet many bandits willing to challenge a full company of arbiters. A full company? Well, I'll be... Ah, whatever. You lot go on ahead. Doubt you're worth the time anyway. Be quick about it and stay out of the way. You're not serious, I hope. You just ordered your men to butcher us. I don't think we're dealing with the sharpest knife in the block here. And then I changed my mind, didn't I? You can save your thanks. I just don't need any of the trouble that seems to follow arbiters everywhere they go. Well, trouble is what you've got. Surrender, or we will pass judgment on you here and now. You? Threatening me? Ha! I gave you every chance to leave with a whole skin. Back to the first plan, everyone. Where they're standing, I want to see a field of corpses, or a forest of them. Oh, you know what I mean. Slay them all! This is the problem with criminal organizations. No standards. The Banyan Span. I ran to the Banyan Span without a plan, and then the man showed up. What can I do? Uh, what what gear do you have, Marin? You have a mall. Good. We're sorted. We're sorted. All right. What am I actually up against here? A whole chunk of them. The positions here are awkward as fuck. Oh man, they're they're high level too. Level thirteens and tens and elevens. The problem is that my main characters are pretty high level. And then it's like Angel and Manati. My mega squishies are level nine. <laughs> Marin out in front. Mizuki healing up the rear. Angel, and a Dean, and I guess Yates, probably? The Gadgeteer could be mega useful, though. 
He's basically saved me once before. But I want... I want... I don't know. Yates is really good too, though. And he can heal. It's hard <laughs> to pick who to go with. We're going with this. <laughs> Healing up the rear? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's gonna shoot. They're gonna keep shooting my casters non-stop. Sometimes I should I wish I could check their speed. So I could place like the slowest people in the back anyway. Cause sometimes the fast people have to walk through everyone, it doesn't really help anything. Fucking rock throwers! Ending a turn without doing anything means your next turn comes up so quicker, which is something I like. Angel is the slowest of the slow. <laughs> oh shit! Marin just went berserk! I could heal that. But not with them. Um, not with Angel. <laughs> What happens if I push her? Hmm. I don't think anything huge. I'd rather just attack, I think. There's 80 damage. See, he doesn't get to move very far. 33 only? Really? Is he like resistant to dark? No, he isn't. Why is he doing so little damage? I'll just heal Marin instead then. So you can actually control yourself. Level up! Does this guy have like mega mega resistance or something? What locust was the coolest? What did we like? The earth locust wasn't half bad. Oh sh I haven't seen that before, that was cool! Can you reach now? Yeah. Everyone's shooting. What the fuck was that? I gotta heal Kyrie too, honestly. Lily Lestrange. <gasps> it's from Harry Potter. Oh, that dude has life font. What a bastard. 
He healed like 40 just from walking. Fifty-nine or Holy Beam Fifty-seven plus something. Yeah, let's do it. Well, it's not massive, but whatever. Luckily that wasn't a lot of damage. And the cave Mizuki renew. Can we have Dark do some decent damage, please? 65, that's more like it. Oh, snap. That was pretty cool. Ow. Also, that's a lot of damage. Hammer them, bitches! Own their face. All right, are you gonna? Yeah, you might as well. Oh no! I mean, I meant I'd rather just kill him in time if I can. How much damage is gonna be? Thirty-one. What about if I enrage blow a hundred? Holy shit! What? Why is that so much more damage? That's that's like three times as much damage. What the fuck? Even just rend? What is this? Is this guy just strong versus normal attacks? Well, this is a special attack, I guess? Fuck me, wall run and rend his fucking face off. Uh, when is Yates' turn? Ah, oh, not for a while. I want to race a zombie. Stop shooting, poor angel! Oh god, she's, in, she's berserk now. That's not good. What? No, what the f- Angel! Oh, you leveled up from it, I guess. <laughs> who cares? Alright, uh, who needs heals? Mizuki needs heals. That's mostly just Mizuki. Everyone else is kind of okay? Yates and name Yates could use some heals. Okay. Oh yeah, that heals. No, they rest him. I was about to raise him, you bastards. God damn it with your forceful strikes. Eat counter. That is so little damage when it's a normal attack. Rebirth? I don't like that at all. And he heals a lot. I need to go kill the guy who's injured. Oh, he's getting healed. Stop resting! I'm the only one who's allowed to rest. These people don't know the rules of gaming. What? From behind? That's a lot of damage. This goddamn gunner, man. Why did he get to hit from behind? <laughs> get wrecked anyway, though. In fact, get mega wrecked. So, a normal attack on this deals holy damage with your equip weapon. I guess that's why. They all are 50% holy. Huh. Interesting. And Rend is just flat out physical. I can kill. Just flat out kill here. That might be worth it, honestly. Despite taking the damage, which isn't great. But we can throw a heal. I would like to do. And we can do... Soon. Shh. 
shit. I was hoping I could give him a heal there, but we're going to have to give a normal heal. Angel, is Angel still going to be Berserk? Yep. God damn it, Angel! <laughs> Stop it! There we go. Ah, <laughs> never mind. Angel's just real mad, real mad. He's like, how dare you? <laughs> oh, Jesus. That was a lot of damage. I need, desperately need some heals on Kyrie now. Oh, shit. Oh, thank God, Kyrie. Hey, you did more damage to your own friend, idiot. Lol. All right, let's do some drain health, honestly. We're going to need it. This will also kill him. Stop doing that. Angel, please! Fuck's sake! Angel, why do you die? <laughs> you die every match! Bleed and blind. That's really not good. What you do? You uh, you have mana for it? Fuck's sake! I well, I desperately need to heal now, so I can't afford that anyway. I think. Rip Angel. Press F in chat for Angel. Honestly, <laughs> so squishy. Forty-six, God damn it! And Rage Blow might be worth it just to get guarantee a kill. He says eighty-four percent. I might miss this. That would suck a lot. Oh, thank God I didn't. Okay, we need some good heals now. This would be a really good heal here. Now we're talking. That goddamn gunner's been shooting me the entire battle. <laughs> yeah, we might need to grind you a bit on lower levels, because you're level 9 and we're up against level 12s and stuff. That doesn't sound like a lot, but I mean, I guess it is. Also, the fact that you're just squishy because you're a caster, and they always just laser focus on you. Are you still blinded? You are. But I have precise strike, thankfully. Oh, God, I want to kill this fucker the most. Can I attack from here? I can. Fucking, this guy's never gonna die! <laughs> stop shoot! You need to stop being the shooty shoot fucker from over there. I really dislike you. Okay, it's time to get a fucking zombie on the board. Lily, come back to me! Hmm. 
lead. Oh, I didn't lead. But leveled up, though. Wait a minute. If I move, I think it's a higher chance of um, Lily getting to hit. Stop going after my casters. My poor casters. Oh boy. No. God damn it. Don't murder my fucking caster. <sighs> You're still blind, so precise strike it is. Lily, get to work. Oh, it's this fucker. No, don't berserk my cat. Oh, thank God you're immune or something. I need, desperately need to heal on Yates. That's the thing. All right, come on. Get some killing on. <sighs> well, fuck off then. Hello, Olivia. You're not allowed to heal! <laughs> I get angry when they heal and, and rest. That's against the rules. Fucking renew! Oh, come on! 67? It couldn't have been 68. I guess in Rage Blow it is. Still blinded, right? No, just bleeding. This is some drain hell. It's only gonna be 29, but fuck it. Why? <laughs> Leave my casters alone! Oh god, he might die now. Because he's gonna shoot the- yep, yep. <gasps> oh, he might die to bleed! Unless I'm really quick at healing and stuff. Keep him alive! <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> they cannot leave my casters alone. Dark in your face! 36? So little. Kill him instead. Almost, apparently. Still bleeding. Victory? What? Oh, I guess I did kill him. He just got real low. MVP Anadine! Everyone got 200 AP, though, so that's not bad. Angel injured again. <laughs> I'm sorry, Angel. It keeps happening. I guess the goal was to kill him. I didn't realize that kind of... Should have probably done that sooner. Than... What should we do with him? It's inconvenient, but I won't strike down an unarmed man, especially one in this state. We'll take him to the nearest Arbiter Chapter House. They can decide his fate. The closest is Despairus, but the Chapter House there is too small to take prisoners. Then he travels with us for the time being, or he would if he was able to walk. Yates, is there anything you can do to get him in marching condition? This is... this is bizarre. <laughs> like... He attacked us, we almost killed him, and I was like, well, I guess we need to heal him so he can travel. You know, it's a bit weird. <laughs> but the variety of lacerations, contusions, and traumas plaguing this man are of no interest to me whatsoever. But I thought you were a famous doctor. Aren't doctors supposed to treat anyone in need? 
I am not a simple country doctor, nor am I a veterinarian or a witch. My healing gift is dispensed only to the deserving or the interestingly afflicted. That man is neither. I see. That's right, you are an asshole. Hello, fellow arbiters. Hello? I'm Captain Dolman, and you're Captain Kyrie, yes? Well met, Dolman. It is gratifying to meet fellow arbiters on the road. What brings you to this area? I've heard about your reputation for directness. I like it. We're on patrol, simply looking out for anyone in need, and clearing the roads of filth when we find it. I also heard about your new mark status. I'm surprised you took time away from the pilgrimage to sort out this riffraff. Thinking us helpless travelers, this scum was planning to put our entire group to the sword for no better reason than robbery. Such flagrant villainy is not something I'm willing to let pass. I understand completely. No arbiter worth their salt would allow this type to run free. But now this blackguard has burdened you with another problem. The Sparrow's chapter house cannot accommodate prisoners. And I'm sure you want to return to your pilgrimage. Why don't we take him off your hands? That would be much appreciated. I smell a rat! There's gonna be something suspicious about this guy and how he's getting him off our hands. It's suspicious that he comes along in the middle of nowhere to solve our problem so easy. Get him ready for travel. I want to see him just kill him. They, they just kill him. No? Okay. We'll be on our way then. I'm glad to meet you, Captain Kyrie. I wish you the best of luck on your pilgrimage. And a good journey to you too and your team, Captain Dolman. There's something real susp. Very susp about this. How fortuitous. How convenient. Seems to be, doesn't it? A skirmish costs us valuable time. Let's get moving. Stop at the spares to resupply and then on to the next temple. Thank you for the information, Madam Mayor. Ooh, this is a nice looking town. After resupply, we'll be on our way promptly. The fuck is that guy at the bottom? There's a naked guy at the bottom of the screen! He's just sort of kneeling in front of a... What the fuck is that? What's the word in town? I'm curious about that man! The Sparrows was attacked by some very determined bandits just a few days ago. Sounds like it was the same group we defeated on the road to town. They must have been preparing for a second attempt when we ran into them. Fortunately for the town's folks, a member of Sigil were in town. With their help, the attack was quickly routed. Ah, thank you, Anadine. We can always rely on Anadine to be the audience stand-in to ask us questions. So we can get it. What sigil? A group of malcontents who opposed the rule of the immortals. They want everything to go back to the way it was before the Immortal Council. Calling it now, they're secretly the good guys. And, uh, and we're gonna join them. You wouldn't have heard about them in the capital. They dare not show their faces there for obvious reasons, involving all powerful beings. Though they've been active for decades, Sigil's cause has never been popular. Until recently. New leadership, I heard. No, I've never heard of them. Who would be foolish enough to oppose the Immortals? Some people are unhappy with the rule of the Immortals. With the right leaders, a dissident group like Sigil can quickly become a threat. Are they recruiting here in town? Actually, no. After driving off the bandits, they headed straight for the temple with several crates of supplies. As far as the town people know, they haven't returned. That's unexpected. We should find out what they're up to. Make sure everyone's ready for the trouble. I don't want to get caught napping. No follow-up to weird naked guy kneeling? Maybe in the event. Look at that guy's hair on the right, though. God damn. Oh, he's leaving. Interesting hair. All the interesting people immediately leave. <laughs> ah, the good old city. Keeps growing and growing. I wonder sometimes if even I recognize it. He's back! Or she, possibly. Interesting hair, guys. Like a judge. Like an old school judge's hair. And also Doggo, yes! There's a Doggo lying there. 
Nonsense. The bones are all the same. Say, do you remember my daring escape from old Radigard's compound? Yes, I'll never forget that. You sprained your ankle coming over the wall, and the old man was right on your heels, ready to give you a hiding. You've half hobbled, half ran down the street. Never before or since have I seen someone sprint with a bum leg. Oh, because I dared to catch a glimpse of his daughter, fully clothed at that. Your poor parents. I think your father would have torn his hair out over your antics if he'd had any left. It's a good thing they had me around around the house to even things out, and... And Alicia. Yes, you can say her name. And Alicia. What happened to her? This is why he's pissed at Yates. Yates did something to fuck it up. Yes, yes, it wasn't my fault. Really, I know. I wish I had been there at the end. That's all. I never considered becoming an arbiter before Alicia. Probably from sheer stubbornness. I was determined not to want the same things you did. Well, you're a captain now, and quite a capable one, if you don't mind me saying it. How could I mind? I say it myself all the time. When do you think you'll want to command your own unit? You know, all it takes is to make the request. I don't know. Right now I'm having too much fun with my sister-in-arms. Besides, where would your command be without my delicately timed levity? Morale would crater. Uh, very well. I do want my own unit one day, but these are troubled times. If something were to happen to you... If I wasn't there when... But Rainer, you don't need to... Yes, except that I do need to. Please, leave it lie. Does Ceridian ever play DBD? Dead by Daylight? Yeah, I mean, I'm not on stream for quite a while, but yeah, I do. Stop bonding, we need to know about Naked Dude. <laughs> exactly, I know! Alright, what are we looking at now? It's time to go into this again. Um, I want to pick maybe a health expert. That's what I'm saving up for, I think. More points in marked? I, this is still question mark, question mark. Why is it question mark, question mark? Is it, do, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Alright. Mizuki. Points in Druid. Mass shield or mass ages. I think mass shield is more useful at the moment. Rainer can pick up... Oh, none of these are... Like, I think... Precise, well, these are both really useful, actually. But Precise Strike is more likely to be useful more of the time. Flash Strike is good too, but... Yeah. Manati picked up a few points in Spillover Mercenary. Why not? Angel got up... Despite dying, <laughs> a bunch of points in Druid. Sapphire didn't get anything, sadly. Turn somehow managed to grab Spillover Mercenary. And... More peddler points. Critical expertise is good, but I'm saving for sales pitch. Spoonman. Plague Doctor points. Into into the fray. Into the fray. Demonic might. Probably pretty strong, this one. And obviously get rid of a smart cast. What? Oh, because it's over there. Duh. Maybe save for Cripple. I do want to pick up Legendary Healer eventually, but maybe not yet. Oh, I want both of these. Counterattack is the biggest one I think you need, though. Counterattack! Counterattack! 
All right.